lost my luggage, my passport. That's how we opening up this video. But yeah, I was like, maybe I shouldn't make this video, but I was like, let me make it because another person might experience the same thing. We shouldn't only document like the happy moments and stuff. But before that, let me take you on my journey, how I left home and came here to Taiwan. And I'll also just show you around the hotel and um, yeah, check out the journey. So the day before I left, I tried to go fetch my passport, but couldn't get it. So I took my son all around town to get toys. I was just trying to spend the last couple of days with him, well, 24 hours, um, just to spend time with him before I left. And yeah, after this, I went home and continued packing. So what you don't see here is that I had been waiting for hours and hours for my brother to take me to Joburg because I had forgotten my phone at home. So my shuttle left me and it was a mess. I was late for my flight but we finally made it. Um, barely though because I was late, 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 late. So this is me. check in we the lady at the desk had so much attitude you know most but we made it inside the flight this is the food that was offered and yeah So this was my second flight. I took first flight from South Africa to Qatar and then this is, this is from Qatar to Hong Kong. So far this journey was fine, but things just went downhill from here. <laughs> south this flight over here is about to delay for two hours so um we took it fine at, at, at doha um this was me just taking pictures of the airport and how nice it looks but this flight delayed for two hours so i arrived in hong kong two hours late so i had to run literally run and it was just so bad and um by the time i got to the gate they told me my luggage couldn't be located or it was delayed something like that but basically i couldn't have my luggage and mind you in my like my carry-on bag i only had like my laptop and a few documents i did not have any for like sort of clothing or anything like that but hey this is me still taking videos even though Yay, yay. <laughs>
run after this guy he works for the next flight i won't mention it because i don't want to put people in trouble but yes so we had to run after this guy because he actually fetched us from the um the previous flight and then we also followed this lady over here they were literally pushing people away so that we just make it to the gate and the gate is probably 30 minutes walk you know so by the time i got there i was just exhausted this is the guy we had to run after Those are my jeans. These are the only jeans that I have. This is the only like piece of clothing that I have, other than the clothes that I had on my back, like the, the clothes that I was wearing throughout. And that's like 22 hours, so I can't repeat the same clothes today. And I need to go to work. So, yeah. So I was just start at the beginning. Um, this is just the cardboard. This is the restroom. I've already taken a shower. Okay, I'm taking a shower all the bath. Don't mind my crustiness. <laughs> it's been the long journey. So this is just standard. Um, like you for me, I I pack these pants in my like in my carryover. That's a story for another day how I ended up having clothes in my luggage because my luggage was overweight. So I had to transfer some of it to my very own luggage. This is outside. This is the first time I've been in the city. It looks nice. I'm gonna try and go outside. So the people who booked the hotel for me, my employer told me there's free breakfast. I said, say no more. I woke up with this, so many problems that I had. I realized that I didn't have my passport. I didn't know where my passport was. It was a mess, okay? No luggage, no passport. Same clothes for like a day now, a full day. But I was like, you know what? <laughs> I am going to go and have that breakfast and just pretend like this thing is not happening to me right now in a foreign country without a passport, without my luggage. So yeah, please join me on the next video where I'll be taking you on my journey in Taiwan and what I will be getting up to and how I will transition into the country. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. Please subscribe and like. Bye!